Welcome back to another video, you lovely souls. I hope you all are taking care of yourself and staying open and ready to receive because beautiful things are about to start entering your life, baby. All you got to do is believe it and stay open, okay? Let's go ahead and jump into this video, baby. I want to say it like this. There is this one important meaning to life that we all must understand because it's always happening in our lives and we just have not or we are starting to learn how to handle this shit. And that is challenges, baby. Say how many of you guess what it was down below? Let me know in the comment section. This is an important meaning to life is challenges. How do you handle your challenges in your life? Because once, be once before I used to handle my challenges in a place where they would beat me up defeat me i would self-sabotage talk crazy to myself in an ugly critical you know nasty way that wasn't cool at all and you know the, the words that we say to ourselves are the most important words we will ever hear in our life so when we self-talk negatively about ourselves, that is not good because we start to believe the things that we are saying to ourselves. we start to believe this about ourselves Okay. So I want to say like, so the challenges that we experience in our life, one thing I want to tell you is don't beat yourself up for the challenges. Everything is happening for you. Life is happening for you. It's all working in your favor and it's all happening through you. You just got to see it that way. Sometimes we all get caught up in a place where it's like, if something doesn't work out, if something doesn't go as we thought, if it doesn't go as planned, we start to feel some type of way and we start over here talking crazy to ourselves beating ourselves up getting mad and angry staying in this type of energy for god knows how long because sometimes it stays and moves to the next day and the next day and we never understand what was being shown to us because we beat ourselves up. And it's so natural because I believe this is the way we were taught on TV. Everything showed us to beat yourself up, to get mad, to react, to get angry, to get frustrated, baby. When there will come a time in your life and maybe after this video, if you ain't already doing so, when, when challenges come through, you're going you gonna to face them challenges and see why is this challenge here? What is it here to teach me? What is the lesson in this challenge? What is it that I need to learn from this? I don't have to talk crazy to myself. I don't have to do the negative step talk. I don't have to run and hide. I don't have to give up. I can keep going. All I got to do is figure out why am I facing with this challenge? How did this challenge enter my life? What is it here for? So that you can begin to, to uh, face your challenges with a smile, with a dance. Hey, because that's how proud you're going to be when you get through it. So go ahead and feel that now. Feel great about it being here. Like, okay, I know this is a challenge, bro, but say, what is this here? You feel me? What is this trying to show me? Sometimes I be here like this, like, what, 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 why is this here? Let me find out why is this here. Because it ain't just here. I'm not just facing a challenge for nothing. It didn't just magically appear in my life. There's something I need to learn. There's something I need to be taught. And it may be just stop reacting to everything. Stop self-sabotaging. Stop talking crazy to myself during these times and figure out what I need to learn. What do I need to know from this challenge that is presenting itself multiple times in my life? Because you'll notice the same type of challenges that come in your life will come again and again and again again and again till you see the lesson on it till you notice the lesson on it and learn the lesson so they can poof be gone you feel me i tell you one thing <laughs> that was this one thing I, I used to get frustrated by everything if you like me i used to obsess over everything and get frustrated by everything if something break i'm like damn damn why does shit break and i get mad like there's always something and i just started going down a spiral if you notice when she started feeding that negative shit it goes into a spiral the whole story you start talking crazy to yourself and your whole day's just messed up you might you know what i'm saying decide to go self-sabotage and however way that mean, means to you or meant to you and it's just over with i'm done i'm not dealing with this i'm mad i'm angry i'm frustrated and, and, and you think about it how little the, the damn thing was like for me when my toilet would break bro so i'm, I'm gonna do all that because my toilet <laughs> and this lesson kept coming back to me i mean i'm talking about about three or four times did it come in my life until i stopped reacting and learned my lesson and there's many times in my life when things like this have happened but there's also now Back you know, before I was aware of what I'm telling you guys today, 
when I started to see it differently, not in the way that I've always seen it, in a whole nother way. Like I told you, what is this? How is this here? Why is this here? You feel me? So that you can learn the lesson instead of going straight into reacting and getting frustrated and getting mad. I know it can be tough sometimes when you may be having a challenging day. A motherfucker might have got on your nerves all day. Whatever you may be feeling, all of a sudden that breaks. Bro, this is powerful when you learn how to do these things. Because, yes, that happens all the time. Like, I have become so great at handling my challenges that when they come, I don't even notice they were there. Like, oh, shit. Oh, because they changed. <laughs> I finally learned the lessons from all the old ones. And you get to a level where, shit, new challenges start to appear. But you notice that what used to work. Down below at a lower level does not work when you get to a higher level. You got to know that that doesn't work no more. You feel me? So I'm just giving game right now that you can face your challenges with a smile. With, with thinking, why are they there? You don't have to react. You don't have to get pissed. You don't have to let that ruin your day, your moment. None of that. You can just see why they're there so you can learn the lesson. Because many of us miss the lessons because we get frustrated with the challenges that have come into our life, baby. And all we got to do is see why it's there. I love you guys, baby. Everybody should learn this one most powerful meaning to life is how to handle challenges because they will always come. And there's going to become a time when you get tired of running and hiding and, and throwing in the towel and quitting and, 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 um, and letting them beat you because it's something so simple. Just look at it because you're going to see that whatever. Whatever was that that is challenging you, especially whenever it's pretty dumb, you know, no shade or nothing. But when it's something like for me, many of the things that I was getting frustrated about, it was never worth it. It was not worth the energy nor the time of being frustrated and mad at all. Most of the time, it's like that's what made me not be able to see why it was there. You feel me? Like it was trying to. To, to show me something in my life. Like things be happening in our life that we don't understand. But it's benefiting us some way, form, or fashion. We may not understand it right now. It may not make sense. But it is beneficial to our lives. So once you learn how to handle challenges in your life. And come to a place of calmness, of stillness. And, and really see your way through these challenges. You're going to become great at them. Because they do get bigger. But they just seem easier because you keep growing more powerful, baby. That's real talk. So everyone, all of us humans must learn how to handle challenges that come into our life. <laughs> At first they saw us, they seem to start small and be pretty dumb and petty. Then they, you know, they grow bigger because we start doing new things and trying new things. And we start facing these challenges. But we just, we, we just become more powerful, more strong and start to see things more clearly. So, I hope this video was helpful to each and every one of you out here. I know it was. You feel me? So, go ahead and smash that like button if you found messages here. If you feel this video resonated with you. And let me know down below in the comment section some things in your life you look back at and that you were struggling with. That you ch that challenged you for a long time. And you look back now like, damn, that was dumb. Why did I do that? Why didn't I just stop and think? That's the comment. Like, stop and think. Like, why is this here? You feel me? I, I mean, like, bro, it, it's tripped out. It, it, it does. It, you you'll start to notice as you continuously grow that what used to piss you off that you that, that maybe it was a challenge that used to piss you off it don't even make you don't budge you don't even feel that energy in your body no more because you got rid of you don't even resonate with that shit no more man that's why i say things be happening for us in ways that we don't understand right there what i just said is a, a big reason why there be trapped energies in our body that's been you know i guess you could say how the simplest way i can say this there be energy in our bodies from our, all things from our life and whatever our subconscious mind is, is, is saying to us and the pictures that are painted in our mind and we're responding to that energy hits our body and we respond until we learn how to clear out this space and release this energy you feel me and I don't want to go too deep into that. I just want to say it just like that. So things like this, like our challenges, sometimes are tied to this type of things. But I mean, it's not worth trying to figure out or all, all those things. It's just best to know that uh, challenge will occur in our life, but we can choose how we choose to react to it. We don't have to react. We can think and find out why it's there because most of the time there's a lesson to be learned for us in our lives that we may not clearly just understand why just yet. But the universe knows why. Your source knows why. I love each and every one of you. Share this video with your mama, your daddy, your sister, your brother, your cousin. Hey, I like that. Hey, anyone you feel you want to share this video with, real talk. And if you're watching my videos and finding messages here, baby, consider to 
tapping into the full awareness, love, and light that I share here with you guys each and every day by smashing that subscribe button and that bell. Say on some real talk. We all have to learn this in life, how to handle these challenges, baby, because they be getting real sometimes, but it's all about how we be feeling. Always pay attention to your energy and come back to see me, baby, because Miss Kelly Travel Spirit, she's checking out. Peace.